Hey guys, it's Cassie. Welcome to my channel if you're new. Welcome back to my channel. If you're a seasoned member of the 2102 crew and you would know exactly how it's about to go down today. Ladies and gentlemen, the Met Gala happened last night. Yes, the Oscars of fashion. So before we get into this video and before I judge the celebrities, I'm gonna need you to subscribe. You're gonna love it. Don't think twice. You're gonna love our family. We're amazing. Press the red button, subscribe, turn on the notification bell while you're there. Um, let us begin, shall we? So this year's theme is heavenly bodies, fashion, and the Catholic imagination. So, imagination. Imagination. Okay. So, I want to see royalty. I want to see religious symbolism. I want to see opulence. Okay? I need, I need extra. I need... I need renaissance. I need a little swig of Catholicism. I need a little bit of da Vinci. I need it all, okay? So, let's see who brought it, shall we? <laughs> so, Selena Gomez has come in a glorified nighty. Um, also, I feel like, yep, yeah, I'm correct. Her lipstick washes her out. So, mm -mm. Nikki. Nikki, oh God. Okay, she's wearing Oscar de la Renta, R.I.P. What a babe, okay? But again, what you're not with the theme. You're not with the theme. She's still in the mindset of Chun-Li. Okay, I know your music video only dropped last week and you know, you're still trying to ride the hype and I love you. I love you, Nikki. But this is not the theme. It's not the theme and this dress is very average. Just this little extra thing is kind of cute, but no. Mm -mm. No, Chun-Li should have been left at home. Oh, Blake sodding lively. Here she is. Of course, she's in sodding Versace because Donatella plays no games. Okay, I'm loving it. Okay, I'm loving the huge train. I'm loving the red. I'm loving the red with the gold detailing. It's everything. Do I see even mesh? And there's mesh just to give it that little, that little bit of spice, that little bit of sexiness. She looks fabulous. The hair is fabulous. There's a hair piece in there. I'm living for it. She just looks glorious. Irina Shayak. Is it Shayak? Is it Shake? Whatever it is. Again, a sexy human being. Okay? Just a glorious, glorious human. She looks fabulous. I love the dress. It's Versace. Told you! Donatella's at it again. Um, yeah, she looks absolutely beautiful and fabulous. Is it in keeping with the theme? No, so you get marked down for that. Irina. 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 Also, Bradley Cooper has aged. And not well. Okay, Solange is here, and it's interesting. It's, it's interesting. She, she likes to confuse us with her looks, doesn't she? Okay, Kim K. Kim K wore Versace. The only thing that was in keeping with the theme was the two crosses on the front of the dress. Yes, it's gold chain mail. Yes, we're taking it back to Gianni Versace when he did the gold chain mail with the models. I see it, I see it. Also, her hair and makeup looks great. But this is the Met Sodding Gala. How many times do I need to tell you? You need to step it up. Also, bitch, that waist trainer's working. Have you seen? Have you seen this hourglass sodding body? She looks great. Okay, we can't take that away from her. Is it within the theme? No. Is it going to be the best look of the night? No. Does she look fantastic? Yes. Oh! Oh! Okay. I'm not massively here for the actual outfit, but gotta love a bit of Cardi B. So, firstly, in with the theme. Yes, I see pearls, I see gems, I see the titties very high up there. Um, she's in Moschino. Again, the dress itself I'm not here for, but you know what? A, I love the fact that she was invited. B, I love the fact that she is in keeping with the theme and she is trying her sodding best, okay? Which is better than what some of you bitches have done thus far. So props, snaps for Cardi. Cara Delevingne. Okay, can I, can I say yes to the headpiece but no to everything else? Cara, I love, I love everything from the neck up. From the neck up, you're doing great sis but from mm, the dress itself oh um, madonna here's the thing i had hope because like a prayer 
like a virgin, is it like a prayer? You know, she did a lot of songs like this. She's always played a bit with religion during her career, hasn't she? And I will say, I love the crown. I, everything else is just, she looks like some horrible character in those horror films when like it just goes black and then you just see the face of just like a horrible crippled nun. That is what the nun is wearing in those horror films. Kylie Jenner and Travis. Travis, let's just put you to the side because I really don't know what this belt situation is that you've got going on. Kylie, is it a cute look? Yes, it's Alexander Wang. And if you do notice, her tights have crystallized Alexander Wang. Again, loving that detail. Again, loving the detail of the glasses. Is it Met Gala? No. It's not. You could have done this for the sodding Grammys. I mean, we just need to level it up. We need to level it up, people. I love Ruby Rose, okay? She is a babe, once again. Again, this dress is not doing anything for you. What has, t what has Tommy Hilfiger done to you? Why? Oh, you're so fabulous, why? No, this is just nothing, it's just nothing. It's boring. Chadwick Boseman, yes. I love it, I am, oh, oh. I think it's Versace, I, killing it, absolutely killing it. The Olsen twins are back, wrapped in a curtain and this one's just gone sod it, I'll wear my sodden robe. Gigi Hadid, of course you're gonna be in Versace. Again, I love the fact that it's Versace. I love the dress, is it giving me heavenly bodies? No. Um, I, I like it, but it's not, it's not everything for me. It's not. Natasha Polly, I love it. Over the top, embellished. I love the blue, I love the cross in the centre. I'm here for it. I love the mini train, but there's still a train. I'm very here for it. She looks stunning. You gotta love a bit of Jared Leto. You know what? He brings it home for the boys. I know he dresses mental all the time. Like, right now, there's something happening. But he's giving me a Jesus moment, and I'm very here for it. I'm loving it. Go for it. I know that it's Gucci. I don't even need to scroll down. Oh, I'm so good. Jennifer Sodin Lopez. Look at her. <gasps> yes. You see? Here I'm getting heavenly bodies. Oh, she's in Balmain. You see the cross on the chest. We've got some, some flesh on show. We've got a high leg because guess what? Her thighs are magnificent. We've got a train. The hair is slick back because there's so much happening on the outfit. You, want, you, do, you don't want to lose focus. The embellishments, everything. Miley Cyrus. I love you, but what is this? It's just like a sexy Ursula from The Little Mermaid. Oh, Anne Hathaway, what has happened to you? Winnie Harlow is bringing it. Mm -hmm. I love it. I love the all white. One thing I will say is that the corset looks abnormally big. Am I right? Tommy Hilfiger. The corset looks abnormally big for what's happening here. However, I am here for the headpiece. Also the rest of the dress. Let's scrap the dress. Neck up once again. We've got a Cara Delevingne neck up. She's looking great. She's killing it. I love it. <gasps> Kendall Jenner. Why? What are you wearing in off-white? She literally just looks like she's just laid down and just like rolled in some toilet paper. No! Even look at how long! Have you seen the trains of the trousers? Have you seen how long that is? That is a trip hazard. <sighs> He's back. Jaden Smith is back. Gold single certification. No need to show off. He could have just tweeted about it. My gosh. I mean, he's here in Louis Vuitton. Yes, his coat is great. And apart from that, he's not within theme. So you can sod off. I love SJP. I love Sarah Jessica Parker. But she looks like some sort of Queen of Hearts. Wow, I will say the headpiece is very ornate, okay? The headpiece, which literally resembled something in St. Peter's Basilica. Okay, so that's, that's impressive. Okay, I can't get down with Katy Perry as a person. I just, I'm just not here for her, I'm not. Do I love the fact that she had massive big wings? Yes. Do I hate the fact that she did massive big wings and I like it? Yes. However, the rest of the outfit is truly terrible. <gasps> I think I just saw Jordan Dunn's cooch. I love, this is what I was after. This is what I was after. Ariana Grande is in, ooh, a painted Vera Wang gown, right? 
and she had this cute bow and I loved it. I loved it. It was renaissance. It was giving me religion. It was giving me, I love it. I love it. It's very cute. It's very her. Of course her face is beautiful and whatever, but I just love it. I love this look. Yes. Okay, controversial opinion. Kate Moss means nothing to me. I don't think she's iconic. I don't think she's pretty. And here she is wearing a black mini dress with some feather action around the neck to the Met Gala. We're done. We're done. Because guess who won it again? Guess who won it again? Rihanna, ladies and gentlemen. Why does anybody else turn up? Ho oh, ho! I don't know where to start. Okay, we've got the Pope symbolism here. I'm loving it. I'm loving it. Rihanna for the next Pope, please. I am loving it. I am loving the... I'm not going to use the right terminology for anything, but I'm loving the, the, uh, the over the, is this a cape? It's a thing. I'm loving that. I'm loving the mini dress underneath. I'm loving the shoes. I'm loving her. Oh, I love the fact that she's just, she's just a thick goddess. Thick with three C's. And you know what? The, oh, the embellishment. You know that that's heavy. And look, she's carrying it off like she's nothing, like it's nothing. Why? Because she's Rihanna and she just wins. Have you even seen how they stuck this thing, this hair to the side of the head and made that look chic? <gasps> what an absolute goddess. Give it to me, Rita Ora. Christian Coombs' whole getup. Yes, ornate with the sodden crown. Kill it, B. Yes, I love that. Okay, guys, there we go. That was my Met Gala Best and Worst Dressed. What do you think? Let me know in the comments below. I need to know who's you liked, who's you didn't like. Do you agree with me? Do you disagree with me? Let me know down below. Also, like this video if you enjoyed it so our family can grow. Subscribe once again if you haven't because if you got this far, you enjoyed it. So go ahead, click the red button, put the notification bells on. And I will see you in my next video. Have an amazing morning, afternoon, evening, wherever you are. Love you guys. Bye.